Good morning, everyone. It's Saturday. Welcome to our weekend vlog. Yes, I'm in the kitchen. You guys know it's about ready to go down. Saturday morning breakfast. Unfortunately, no Mason though. And I know if you guys came from the last vlog, you are patiently waiting to hear about baseball. Guess what? Mason is back at baseball practice he had. Early morning baseball practice this morning on their Saturday. Um, and then there's a parent we have to go back up to the school around 10 or at least one parent or one player. So basically if your player's old enough to drive, they can go up themselves. It's so crazy to think that we will be there before we know it. Like Mason can drive and do all this stuff on his own. But for now, he'll need a parent to drive him up there. He will come home eventually and talk about baseball and how it went last night. Cause I know a lot of you guys are sitting here patiently waiting for the news of how baseball went for Mason. He did go to his first practice last night because if you watched the last vlog, we explained he wasn't able to go until his basketball season officially was over, which happened Thursday night after his game. So Friday he was allowed to go to baseball. <laughs> Time for some breakfast. What are you guys doing in here? You getting morning loves? Yes. Aw, good morning Ace. Happy weekend. I know he's missing, um... so this morning was weird because Normally, Jack and Mason are gone in the morning, and it's just Ace and I, but this morning, Jack dropped Mason off at baseball practice and then came home, and Ace was like, huh? huh? He's so smart, he knows like our routines. Um, and then I think that kind of confused him this morning, but um, yeah, so they're doing their morning snuggles. This is what I normally get every morning while you're at work. Are you snuggling? <laughs> All right, let's get some breakfast. And then I guess I'll just make a little plate for Mason so that he can um, eat before he has to go back up to his school. But happy Saturday. Welcome to our weekend vlog. Guys, look who's home, showered, cleaned. My Mason. I've missed you. I feel like between last night and today, I haven't seen him. And I know you guys haven't seen him because I don't think he really was in the vlog at all this past vlog. He's a busy kid. But anyways, how's baseball going? Good. Yeah? It is definitely baseball season. So he had two practices so far, like we've been saying last night and then early morning practice this morning. And then, I guess it's pretty much official, you guys. Jack had to go back to school with Mason and pay money for uniforms. <laughs> so it is definitely official. We are definitely, I like that you're wearing this today in baseball season. See how uh, this goes, right? But since it is officially baseball season, is the dog okay? <laughs> Being bad? He's eating the carpet. Eating the carpet. Sir, excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> uh, never fails. Did you just eat a toy? There's a toy. But anyways, since it's baseball season, it was time. So a couple of vlogs ago, Mason got his new cleats. Um, we actually just ordered a new batting helmet that'll come in this week because his games are already starting like soon, very soon. So we need to be prepared. So one of the things that he needed, um, do you want to show them? What do you got? The next generation of batting gloves. Yes, sir. We got Jack's batting gloves. I like the color. It actually, we just, the helmet we ordered, it's going to match perfect. Right. So you guys know that Mason made the switch to Jack's batting gloves. Uh, how long ago, Jack? A few years at least now at this point, yeah. Yeah, loves these gloves. Um, we actually now have a promo code for you guys if you've been following on my Instagram. I've put it on there quite a few times. Um, it's Bevo Fam, B-E-V-O-F-A-M. And that's gonna get you free shipping. So hey, free, free is free. This is their new technology too. So these are, mm -hmm. Mason's opinion, the best batting gloves in the game, period. Mm -hmm. So they are, grip wise, everything, they are just the best batting gloves. He loves these batting gloves. And the design of these ones. I know some of you guys have um, purchased the new um, Jack batting gloves and I've gotten DMs. Um, we've gotten comments on our, um, YouTube videos that you guys love them, that your kids are loving them. So that makes my heart happy. Um, 
Um, yeah, use our promo code if you guys are ready to make the switch to the Jack's better batting grip, gloves. Better control. The difference between these batting gloves and normal batting gloves is it has, instead of you have to buy a thumb piece for the bat, mm -hmm. it has this right here. It's already in there. It. So it's perfect right here. Yep. And also, uh, this design compared to their uh, older ones, this newer one, mm -hmm. is a more of like a leather, so they might last even longer. Now. Awesome, okay. Mm -hmm. And they're Very good. super comfortable, obviously. Yep. Yeah, they're designed for durability. Like, like this part is very durable right here. Mm -hmm. It's like leather. They do last a long time. Mm -hmm. Absolutely love these matting gloves, and you can go back to the last probably two years of baseball games just to see these things. Once he made the switch, he came to me, he's like, I think I want to try these. And ever since then, once he made the switch, mm -hmm. he's never looked back. Loves them. I think so. This is the first time he's had the gray ones. He's done Correct. the white ones. He's done the red, white, blue ones. Well, they do variations. This oh, and I believe that they can match your school colors if the whole school, if your whole team wants to get yes. Jack's or your club team, too. It doesn't yeah. have to be your school, but yes. So you I can DM them or get though. a hold of them, yeah. So very cool. Yeah. Shout out to Jax. Thank you for sending these out. We love them, and like we always say, we don't just talk about stuff to talk about it. He swears by it. That's why we talk about it. That's why yep. we promote it. So we love this brand 100%. and everything they're all about. So all right, and then I think a letter got a came. fan letter too. Yeah, this one is from Philadelphia, PA. So I'll take this one, Mason. Need a little tired from baseball. <laughs> to Chrissy, Mason, and Jack. My name is Kyle. I'm from Philadelphia. I like you already. So Mason is a sweet baseball swing. We we're just talking about that with the batting gloves. <laughs> He's eighth grader, going to a high school in Philly that a lot of friends and family of mine went to. And I know exactly what high school it is. Actually, your high school was the high school I was about to go to, and then we moved out here to uh, Phoenix. So Excellent. that would have been where I went. He's a four for four fan like we are. Yeah. Eagles, Flyers, Sixers, Phillies. Phillies. <laughs> it's a five for five if you throw the Union in there. That's but, uh, Plays for the Ron Hurst Raiders, and he always plays against the Holy Terrors. Do you know what the Holy Terrors are? No. That was my that club was that I played for. Dad's team. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's cool. Jason, who's your favorite baseball player? Probably Bryce Harper, I mean. That's a good one. Like Chrissy, what's your favorite food? Mexican food. Mm, that's true, very that's true. Good. Hope you guys have a good Easter. If this gets there by Easter and have a good 4th of July. Also tell Jack I always beat the Holy Terrors. Why you gotta bring it up, man? Why you gotta bring up old stuff? <laughs> that's <laughs> funny. Very cool, awesome. Have a good rest of your day. And he put some sports cards in there for us from Kyle. Thank you, Kyle. Thank you, Kyle. Yeah, they no longer play for the Holy Terror, so it's okay if you beat them all the time. <laughs> now, if you watch us, we're rooting for you, so hopefully you keep beating them. Mm -hmm. so. On note, you guys, I am in desperate need to go to Sam's Club. It's been, I think the last time we went is when we got the dog food, and guess what? We need dog food. Mm -hmm. So it is time to go to Sam's Club and get more dog food, and then a few other items. I think we're going to try to put, oh, did you find something? I gotta give one shout out to Kyle, oh, okay. <laughs> There's a Jack stack, Aww. and it starts with Michael Jack. Oh, yeah. that's cool. So very cool, very kind. Like you said, you guys can just write us letters. You don't have to do this. We definitely appreciate it. Oh, you got me a junior AI. <laughs> really? Yeah, it's a good stack Aww. right here, my friend. Thank <laughs> you. Thoughtful. Oh, wow, very cool. That's yeah, it's awesome. very kind, too kind. Oh. Press her for trunk card. Ooh. That is very nice. Fancy. All right, so the boys are going to continue to go through those. We'll keep and looking I at these. think, Jack, are you going to go to Sam's Club with me? Well, now I have cards to look at. I'm sorry. <laughs> Please. But yes. I think we're going to put, um, look at Ace. <laughs> it is nap time. He just ate. Cool. What's in it? He uh, chewing on your teething ring. How's your teething ring? Is it good? I think we're going to put him in his crate for a nap and hit up Sam's Club. Oh, man. What did we do? What did we do? Oh, don't worry. There's more behind me. <laughs> Two parts. Now that's a Sam's Club haul right there. Um, we gotta load it up. We'll go over what we got. But there's some there's some fun stuff back there. I think you guys can probably see a little bit of it. This car's heavy. All right, we made it to the truck. Well, we are home from Sam's Club, and one of the things we got, I think, Somebody's already enjoying it. Did you get bed. a big boy bed? Did you graduate to a big boy bed? Ace. No, I can lay with you. <laughs> no, there's room for you. Um, yeah, we noticed that he was outgrowing his small one because he really sprawls out when he sleeps. So yeah, now he can grow into this one. And I, I think, I think I'm gonna start teaching him how to place 
Yeah. Um, so basically, if we have anybody ever visit us, we just say, you know, Ace Place, and he knows to go to his bed. We'll see how that goes, though. But so far, he loves it. So we got something for our youngest child. We also got something for our oldest child. Did you want to tell him what we got you? <laughs> we got him a bench set. Um, I know all of you guys. He needs to start lifting. He needs to start. He's almost 15. Um, as you can tell, he's definitely growing and getting bigger, doing what he's supposed to be doing at this age. So it's time to put on the muscles, start lifting, and then Me too. you get to use it. And I'm pretty sure I'll use it too. Um, not the heavy weights, obviously, but um, I can at least lift the bar, I would think. Oh, we'll see. But now we're trying to decide, are we gonna put it up in the garage or the computer room? Originally, we said that the computer room was going to be, well, it turned into Mason's school room this yeah. past year because of COVID. But we're thinking about making that into our workout room. Jack really wants a treadmill too. So we're debating on if that room's big enough to have like a treadmill, plus the bench set, but we can also move it around, so we'll see. Um, but for you guys, I this vlog, I'm sure that the sale will still be going on. The uh, bench set was on coupon, it was $30 off. So we've had our eye on it, and we passed it up a few times, but Mason definitely said that he wanted to start lifting weight, so when we were there, it was definitely not a purchase that we were ready to make or thinking that we were gonna make, but with it $30 off, why not? Why not pull We've the trigger? We've been eyeballing it long enough, so when yeah. it's on sale, it's like whatever. Christmas time. Makes the decision easy. Yeah, mm -hmm. we almost pulled the trigger at Christmas time. We got our usual stuff. Look how cute these are. Um, the spring plates are out, so I got those. Our usual, you guys know if you've been following us. Oh, of course, of course, you can't go to Sam's Club and not get like a hot dog or a pretzel. A couple pretzels for the boys. What? Well, what's them? <laughs> Was that English, Mason? Mm -hmm. He has a full mouth. Not, oh, dog food. That's why I, I was talking about that. That's why we need to go to Sam's Club. Guess what? They're out of stock. You can either order it online or there's another Sam's Club that has it in stock. And we're actually thinking about going to my sister's house tomorrow to go to a farmer's market. That Sam's Club is closer to my sister's house, so we might just head there before or after we do the farmer's market. Um, even though we'll have the dog, but I'm just gonna run in there and um, grab the dog food. Hey, I thought we were going bye bye's. You guys, we bought him that big old bed and he's still laying underneath the table. Jack's like, we should just put the bed under there. <laughs> I don't think it'll fit, it's huge. We placed it right wow. there for now. I think that's where it's gonna have to go because it's so big. And I, a few times, Mason's already been working with him, said, um, we're not gonna call it Place because his name is Ace and we don't want him to get confused. That was Jack. Smart, smart Jack. So I think we're gonna call it Bed. So then whenever we say Bed, hopefully he goes there because his crate, we call crate. Some people yeah. call their crate their bed, like they tell the dog go to bed. Luckily we're doing the crate. But right we now. say crate yeah. for that, so we'll see. No. Go to your bed? Where's your bed? Where's your bed? Where's your bed? He's like, uh, he comes we were leaving. you got shoes on and you got that thing in your hand and I don't think so. I think, Ace, you want that one? Is that the one? We have to. Well, buddy, you did good for your first PetSmart run. We just signed him up for puppy training glasses. You ready? We start in a couple weeks. And the trainer was already in love and said, she said that he's super smart and she's so excited that he's gonna be in her class. <laughs> so we'll see how it goes. We also got some treats for him. Um, I'll show you once we get home because he, he did really good in the cart, but this we're gonna- one of them. Oh yeah, the trainer just uh, recommended this it. thing. He loves it. You like that? Oh yeah, she said it's good for his puppy teeth. Thanks, Jack. Ooh. Thanks, Jack. No problem. Thanks, Ace. The boys sat in the car while mom did some grocery shopping. Just a couple bags. I tried to be quick in and out because the dog was in the car. But Jack said he did really good. He actually took a little nap, so that works. But I got some chicken to grill out tonight. Um, some stuff that I just was out of because I hadn't been able to get to Trader Joe's. Um, 
noodle, like gluten-free noodles, my gluten-free cookies that I love. And I did get the new gluten-free muffins. I'm excited to try those. Apparently they're really good. All right, buddy, we're headed home. We're headed home. We got home just in time for dinner time for this guy. Ace, you want food? You want food? You want food? What's in here, Ace? Hopefully we can get you some more food tomorrow. You're almost out. You get so excited to eat. Hey, sit. 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 You so hungry. Sit. Sit, Ace. Stay. Wait. Wait. Wait, show him watch. Wait. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. 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 No. <laughs> Say we're learning. You gotta wait, Ace. Wait. 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 Okay. He's learning, he's learning. New food or no? No. Same one, right? He's going ham on the food. <laughs> he's hungry. We just had a busy day. Oh, it's video games. Good. Are you hungry? Do you need food? Yeah. Yeah? Shamrock? Oh yeah, we can go through that stuff. So we ended up getting that. You saw that at the store. Ooh, sounds like box. I know, smell them. Wow. So it doesn't smell that's like poop, you guys. <laughs> what, who would have thought? More, a lot more training treats. A lot more training okay. treats. Oops, oh, dropped no. one. <laughs> this was uh, on sale for like $3, $4, something like that. What is it? It's the Bark Box, which these toys are awesome. They're expensive normally, but like I said, it was on clearance. So this is um, Get Shredded. It's a protein shake. <laughs> so. You put these inside it's and get that he has to try to, yeah. It's also one of those like, he likes these crinkly oh, toys. Greenies, greenies, dental greenies yes. to keep his teeth clean. Yes sir. And was there one more thing in there? Do we, oh there it is, this thing. So, I know normally you put peanut butter, but we obviously try not to have peanut butter in the house because of this dude's allergy. But they said yogurt, smushed bananas, and then you can freeze it, and then they just lick it, and it keeps them busy, and their brain going. Papa, we put them in the almond butter ground. I don't know if dogs can have almond butter. No, it's just me. I'm not gonna go through my Trader Joe's haul like I normally do. Wait, what? <laughs> because he's gonna no, speed no, me up anyways. She got to bring it up, she got some beans. <laughs> more beans, more beans. Oh gosh, she's the best red potatoes ever. <laughs> The muffins that I got. Oh, there they are. This is This is what I was talking about. Everybody says they're good, so I'll give them a try. Food. Stuff. Oh, and there's my favorite cookies, if you guys were ever wondering. Right there. Favorite cookies. Alright, boys, put it away. Thanks. And I'll cook dinner. Actually, he's grilling out. He's grilling the chicken. We gotta find the chicken in here somewhere. Dinner is served. Smells good, looks good. It's late, it's after seven. I'm ready to eat. Good morning, Sunday fun day. Got breakfast going, it's kinda early. It's not even eight o'clock yet. But we have plans today, like I said yesterday. Um, I think we're going to go over to my sister's area. There's a farmer's market that they do every Sunday. So I think we're gonna hit that up. All right, let's have some French toast and go have some fun today. Well, we made it to my sister's house and it's the first time that Ace has been in anybody else's house. And of course, he's saying hello to baby. They're being good so far. You can come outside. You can go outside. Look, baby's like, I'll show you. Come on, you gotta come out this way. They're good though. <laughs> 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 you nice, baby. Yeah, they're doing really good. Right Say hi, Mima. What? What? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> their uh, tails are wagging, so that's all good things. To the farmer's market. <laughs> See how he does. Uh, excuse me, miss. I think you did good. <laughs> I think my bag's about ready to break. Yeah, I think actually all that is Mason and, and I between fudge and cookies and, oh no, there's gluten-free cookies in there for you. We'll, we'll show them once we get back to Tim's house. I think shopping tuckered him out. Um, all right, let's see what we got. Mason picked this up. Blueberry jam. Look at the ingredients, guys. That's it. That's awesome. So this is original. 
And then a hot. hot. Barbecue oh, sauce. Ooh. A fancy water, water bottle. Ooh. <laughs> Mom got her treats. I know, I got treats. Gluten free. Those are uh, lemon cookies and granola cookies and lemon cookies. And then we got our treats. Which was we stuff. Whoa. You guys should have got the bigger one. Probably. Probably. Was that it? And it a soap for Ace. Ace, you looked out. So we did pretty good. Yeah. That was fun. Well, we are leaving my sister's house. Oh, can you guys see? He's tuckered out. Mace, you're going to fall asleep too? <laughs> he tuckered out. Did you have fun? Yeah. Fun seeing your cousins. Mm -hmm. It was fun. And for the record, Ace had no accidents in my sister's house. <laughs> I wasn't too concerned because they have all tiled downstairs, so, but no accidents. He um, went to their sliding glass door every time he needed to go out and just kind of scratch. So I think we're pretty much potty trained, Jack. Oh, you just messed up. <laughs> Last time I said that, we had an accident, so I probably just messed up. We need to get, um, I think we talked about this, Ace's dog food, puppy food, is out at our um, Sam's Club. So we're going to a Sam's Club that's closer to my sister's house. So we're headed there now. Fingers crossed. It says that it's in stock, so hopefully they still have some. Well, Ace got a little dirty at my sister's house, so just gave him a second bath ever. And it's dinner time as well. It's kind of dark in here. But he's back to being curly. Let's see if it can curl. Look at that. Curls! Ace! You're so handsome. You smell so good. So much cleaner. You enjoying your dinner? <laughs> he's like, yeah, let me be. Well, you guys, I think on that note, now that Ace is nice and clean and fed. I think we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog. It is a Sunday night. Mason wore his Booker jer or I think jersey is what it's called. Um, we're gonna watch the All-Star game. Did the three-point contest happen already? Are you sleeping? He's tired too. I think somebody stayed up too late last night. Did, who won the three-point contest, do you know? It was Curry. Curry? Yes. Okay. All right. Um, don't forget to like this video. Comment something in the comment section. Subscribe. As always, you guys, we will see you next time. Thanks for watching.